buy their seeds from the big guys every year to plant. Me, I save my own. That's what I do. I'm a seed saver. Come in this year. Bet you're making a killing. That's a lot of money. Look at that. <laughs> Stranger's gonna come into my field and, and take samples of my plants. Junction to take samples from our fields. Okay. Um, well, first things first, I'll call them and we'll set up a time for them to come get samples. They've come already. They're mostly ex cops. Monsanto's claiming the canola you grew in 97 contained a technology in the seeds gene that they created. It's a pesticide resistant gene. It seems that even after your crop is already growing, you can spray the entire field with their herbicide. It's called Roundup. It kills all the weeds, but leaves your crop. They spray the crop and we eat it. If I could just talk to Monsanto, clear this up, but... Monsanto GM seeds I got from my neighbor Carl. How hard would it be to swap these for these? Huh? Sir, accusing them of conspiracy is only going to make you seem more guilty. My advice, once again, you should settle. Give them 10K. Owns a patent to a gene, which when incorporated into canola, renders it tolerant to a powerful herbicide called Roundup. A farmer can kill all the weeds in the field and yet have the crop survive. Through tests conducted on the canola leaf and seed samples taken from Mr. Schmeiser's field, it was determined by no less than three independent laboratories that the seed indeed is property of Monsanto. GM Tech is bad for all independent farmers. It does not matter whether Mr. Schmeiser intentionally used Monsanto seeds or not. The hell it doesn't. No. Miss Telco, I appreciate your passion. I know what I'm talking about. That's very clear, but you're standing in the men's room. It's for men. I'll wait in the hall. Drop in 50 years. And to what would you attribute your success? I'm a seed saver. And, and what does that mean? Well, every summer I study my crops, I get to know them, I study how they react to too much heat, drought, too much rain. I try to find the plants that are the most virile, and I save those seeds for next year's planting. It's how my father taught me to farm, and his father taught him. Mr. Schmeiser, have you ever bought bootleg, roundup-ready canola from anyone? No. 